what's going on world i'm back i just wanted to let you guys know that remember we put that jb weld inside of cylinder number three on here all right so i'm gonna just give y'all guys the update it's been 48 hours 48 hours Well, besides it not starting for other reasons. It's a Ford thing, don't worry about it. I'm happy to announce, happy and sad, and I'll explain why. did that I had to do it because it wasn't actually missing but then taking it for a spin the customer gassed on it for a few minutes and then we started hearing it hissing again I'm like oh man I don't think it actually blew the whole thing out I believe it actually only blew a small part of it out so to combat that I'm putting more JB weld and I also have solidified that um, coil boot inside of the cylinder so it'll never be able to get changed again but this car try to convince them we should probably junk it but four people hang on it's got 238,000 no, 239,000 miles on it so it's lived a very good life <laughs> very good life so this is the last rendezvous um just to put it out there though, JB Weld is not very ideal for compression applications. As you can tell, it will hold for at least a little bit, but um, at right now it sounds smooth. I gotta do a fuel pressure test to check some other things on it, but uh, there you have it. JB Weld to fix a Ford problem that should have never been broken. It can work, don't recommend it, but it can work, especially it's hard to get it in that cylinder. So like the video share the video with somebody who needs to see this i'm gonna get back to testing this thing until next time mi gente be promondo beneficio peace